their phenotypical similarities and because of this we often confuse between both of them now here is the comparison between nunan syndrome and turner syndrome i recommend to stop video here for 20 seconds we can already see the similarities between both of these syndromes such as web neck low set ears pedal edema wide space nipples short stature and congenital heart disease special mention to the congenital heart disease in nunan syndrome is pulmonary stenosis and in turner syndrome the special mentions are bicuspid aortic wall and coarctation of aorta now let's see the differences between both of them in nunan syndrome you will see a normal chromosome numbers on karyotyping because a defect is at gene level but in turner syndrome you will see a missing x chromosome on karyotyping coming to the fact of which disease affect which sex in nunan syndrome both sexes can be involved so patient can be a male or female and here is a catch in turner syndrome only females are affected so there is no male patient in a turner syndrome last two features as a patient of nunan syndrome he or she will have a normal fertility but he or she will have subnormal intelligence in contrary to this a patient of turner syndrome will come to you with a primary amenorrhea and with normal intelligence now let's check what you learn here is the 3 year old male patient with subnormal intelligence with web neck low set ears and widely spaced nipples yes it is nunan syndrome because patient is a male child and has a subnormal intelligence thank you happy learning